So, Grandpa, you sent me a video that apparently said that you could power anything off of two candles. I mean, the moment I saw that, I said, okay, it's BS. I know it already. But just to prove it, um, I've set up the same experiment right here. It consists of, okay, fine, I didn't use nails, um, but they are still magnetic. They're screws um, and a big old magnet to magnetize them. It's out of a hard drive, very powerful magnet. So I can do this and make sure they're both well magnetized. Well enough so that I bet, yeah, I mean, they're definitely magnetized. Um, now, I'm going to take these little alligator leads, clip them on here. Actually, you know, I'm going to do one better than the other guy did. I'm going to definitively prove it because I'm going to hook it up to my oscilloscope. And I just thought of that idea, and so I just need to hook up the scope. Um, that black wire there is from the oscilloscope. So, there's the test lead. Um, and I'm going to hook it up. Um, let's see. There we go. So now the oscilloscope is hooked up. Um, powered on with the thing turned off so that we get a zero reading. And yeah, right now there's a standard background radiation. Uh, and if I lock that, um, switch it to something decent here. Um, let's give it 0.1 volts per division. And we see no line. Actually, I'll step back to this because it's jumping around. It's running about 2.7 millivolts here. Um, let's switch to display mode. Uh, okay, 8.3 millivolts. I mean, it's negligible power, regular background readings. So now I'm going to light the candles. And I now see even less energy coming off of this thing. Uh, which proves that the entire video that was shot was pretty much BS. Um, now, if I go like this, and there is no change in the readings, I'm now going to light the candles again. No change. So, this definitively proves that the video online, you see the candles are lit, my wires go like this to the oscilloscope and back to the um, what is it the uh, the scope here and it says nine po uh, nine point nine millivolts so nowhere near the mythical three volts um, and now when I blow it out um, I still see oh ten point two now nine yep nine point nine millivolts still so nothing and just to prove it again I'm going to hook up a motor that's almost identical to the one that we saw in the video and I'm just grabbing that now and here's that little motor it's very similar and I'm going to clip the leads to that motor I'm going to go clip I got a clip there and I'm going to go ah, come on clip Okay, now we have our little motor that's clipped on. I'm again going to light the handles. And, ooh, isn't that incredible? It doesn't work. So, it's pretty definitive. Uh, candles don't power things. Um, if they did, our cars would run on them, and we would have infinite power forever. But, um, apparently, the truth is not as strange as fiction. And... There is no way to run motors off of these little candles without something like a piezoelectric thermocouple. Um, so, yeah, basically, that's it. And the video is bunked. Next time you send one of these, check it on Snopes first, please. Thanks. Bye.